Good evening, everybody. How's everybody doing tonight? Fishies, we're playing with fishies tonight. Ugh. I have fishies, my friend. Look, I have fishies. Aren't they? We got, they're not cute, but, you know, they're fish. You know. All right, y'all do me a favor. Since we're talking about fish tonight, send it out and reel all your friends in to watch. <laughs> Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. I thought I was the only one that said that while I was fishing. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. All right. While we're waiting for all our friends to join in, I'm going to start cutting my mesh. This is leftover mesh. <laughs> Y'all, I'm loving the leftover mesh with the rectangle boards. <clears throat> it's really helping me clean my sash out of mesh that I've got a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Not enough to do a big wreath. Alright, tonight we're using jute mesh. I love jute mesh. Jute mesh is actually one of my favorites because it gives excellent coverage. Where is everybody? Where is everybody? All right, so jute mesh kind of, it doesn't fray too bad, but it kind of frays just a, enough, and I don't want the straw, so I'm going to cut it 25 inches tonight, I think, I think, I think, eh. I think between both rolls I've got enough. Maybe not. Let's go 20 inches just to be safe. And that'll be fine. Better safe than sorry. Yeah, there was enough. Do 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 do. Well, I'm 
greedy. I want more people. I'm greedy. Alright, so, per as usual, we're going to ruffle this up. And by the way, y'all, I have something brand new that I'm showing y'all tonight. I'm going to show you another good reason to use pipe cleaners every now and then. I didn't say all the time. I said every now and then. Because they do have their perks in designing, just like zip ties do. I do use zip ties every now and then. I don't think I've ever met anybody from Milwaukee. I'm here to tell y'all, using these rectangle boards is like the perfect in craft show quickie wreaths to make. And these are actually really, really helping me clear my stash out of not that much ribbon to make a bigger wreath. <laughs> Love that mesh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I can't be the only one. I know why I'm quiet tonight. Why are y'all quiet? Y'all can't be quiet if I'm quiet. You know why you can't be quiet if I'm quiet? The reason you can't be quiet if I'm quiet is you gotta be talked to give me something to talk about. Tonight it's you talk, I talk. You talk, I talk. I know why I'm quiet. I've had my eyeballs in taxes all day. Well, Miss Leanne, welcome. I'm telling you what, when I was recovering from my back surgery, I watched a lot of people live. 
And the reason I watched them live is so that I had socialization. Couldn't get socialization watching replays. But that's just me. I just had back surgery back in December. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Isn't that pretty? So pretty, so nice. So pretty, so nice. And so fluffy and nice. Whoop, whoop. Okay. Welcome to my new friends. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to Unique in the Creek. For those of you that haven't met me, my name is Jackie. Most people call me Jackie B. Okay. I'm one of the designers here with Unique in the Creek for Team Unique. And I also have my own business, Jackie's Wreaths and Things. So, welcome. Alright, so tonight, because my greenery is fairly long. Okay, I've already scoped it out. My greenery is fairly long. I'm going to cut my ribbon 14 inches. And I'm going to be using the Measure Buddy. And you just need eight pieces of ribbon. Um, I don't have that kit, Christina. But I will tell y'all this much. If ever you want to see 